Now when you go fishing, I really think it's important to be prepared and have a bit of a plan in your head when you go. However, it's also really important that when you get there, that you are flexible and adaptable to whatever opportunities present themselves. Um, this morning, whilst I've been float fishing, I've also been throwing out a few dog biscuits onto the surface and uh, I've got some carp feeding quite confidently off the surface. So rather than the traditional approach, I've got my fly rod um, and a little imitation mixer biscuit and uh, we're going to see if we can get a carp off the top on the fly. So on most coarse fishing lakes uh, you're going to be surrounded by wonderful beautiful trees uh, which is great to look at and fish under um, but an absolute nightmare when you're trying to cast. So the cast I'm doing here is a roll cast I'm not the best fly fisher, uh, but it's a simple uh, but effective roll cast that's got the bait out in amongst the feeding carp. And a quick strike and the fish is on. And this is where the fun really begins. Fly fishing rods are really built with a fantastic what's called through action, so the whole rod bends. Now this rod is uh, an eight weight rod, it's actually very strong, it'll handle comfortably up to double figures um, so if you if you're anybody who likes a bit of fly fishing and you've got one of these already in your collection uh, a floating line uh, a leader a tapered leader of about well, that finishes an eight pound line and you've got everything that you need really to, to tackle some carp so give this a go this carp's really giving me the run around but it's a lot of fun